Well, hello there. I've decided I'm going to do things a little bit differently this time for Litchfield's Lifestyles. I like to stir things up a little bit, but no, to be honest, it's very nippy out there and I've got a really bad sore throat, so I thought I better do this week's Litchfield Lifestyles from the comfort of my lounge. Um, I'm not going to show you the whole lounge because it does need a little bit of a tidy. Uh, but I have been back to my mum's and I've been sorting out the attic. And in the attic, I forgot I'd even got these, but I've got a load of these Super 8 family cine films. So what I've decided to do, because film deteriorates over time, is I'm, I've got bought the projector back as well, and I'm going to sort of put it against a wall and actually do a little bit of telecineum with this. So it's going to be great to see um, some of my family. I know that some of these belong to my granddad. So it's going to be quite interesting to see um, all the family members from the past on there as well. So I'm dead excited. So let's crack on with this and you can watch as I'm doing it as well. Okay, so what I've done um, is I've stuck a piece of paper onto the door uh, and that's going to act as my projection screen. And um, I've set the projector up so the film is all ready to be loaded. Uh, so what I'm going to do is actually bring the projector quite close to the actual uh, paper and actually have it really a really small frame because I think the colours will be richer and then I'll use this camera that I'm filming on here to actually capture uh, the footage digitally and uh, that way I can archive everything how very exciting and clever of me um, but yeah the projector's all set ready to go so let's have a look and see what films we've got get excited where's my popcorn Well, I've got to say, uh, that film wasn't really that particularly interesting or that exciting. It seemed to be like, uh, it looked like the Spaghetti Junction in Birmingham um, and a load of buses, but it was all out of focus. So, uh, a bit disappointing on that one. Let's see if there's uh, another one with some archives on it. But uh, it's fascinating, actually. To, I remember doing this as a child and um, collecting all these sort of uh, Super 8 films and having... Uh, cinema parties at home. Um, there's something magical about film and the smell of the projector. Oh, I can smell it now. It's like oil. Oh, it's fabulous. Unlike digital technology, with film you have to rewind it back. So uh, that should take about another 15 minutes before I start the next one because I need this reel. So look, this is all the film here. This is a, about a 20 minute film that I've got to uh, rewind on here. Well, some of that was a little bit of emotional. Um, some of it was a little bit disappointing, but I've only done three rolls. But you can see, you know, back in the day when you used to use a cine camera, uh, the films themselves would last about three or four minutes and they would cost just under like 10 pounds. So you had to be quite sparing with what you shot. So as you saw from the Disney film, it was all quite structured, it was quite planned. There wasn't really any wasted shots there. So I'm going to give the projector a bit of a rest because projectors tend to get quite hot and I can smell a little bit of burning inside. So I thought, better give it a little bit of a rest. And um, yeah, and I'm looking forward to seeing the rest of those films, which are probably gonna take me a good week or so to actually put onto uh, digital but I hope you enjoyed it if you have please don't forget click on that subscribe button I really would appreciate it and there's loads more videos for you to flick through